Hello, the Baynet is on the road today, and we're at the pharmacy at PJ Bean, which is located uh, in the Bean Building at uh, Three Notch Road in Hollywood. We're going to talk about flu season, but uh, first uh, we want to uh, speak with uh, Vipul Shah and uh, Prakruti Shah about uh, the pharmacy here at uh, PJ Bean. Uh, so the pharmacy at PJ Bean is completely independently owned and operated. Uh, we started it back in uh, July 2015, July 6th, 2015 was our very first day. And uh, so being independently owned and operated, it does give us a little bit more uh, flexibility in uh, providing our patients with such things as free home delivery, very fast service. We have control of our own staff, so we make sure everyone's extremely friendly, always smiling. You know, it gives, what we wanted to really go for was a, um, a, a good hometown feel. And she, she has worked in the retail pharmacy world, and she told me that I can't, I can't do that. It's not patient, I mean, it's not patient centric. I really need to have a pharmacy where patients know that we're able to help them and we want to do as much as we can uh, to, to make them feel better. In fact, even our, our motto is let's get better together. Okay. So. Well, you've got to be very excited to have, have a business like this. Yes. Um, we started this um, as our first project because I, I worked with the retail, like a corporate retail pharmacy for a very long time. I love interacting with my patients and what I realized is that the patients don't see themselves as a person being treated. They mostly saw themselves just as being treated as a number, as a prescription. So what we are bringing to the pharmacy is where we know our patients. We, I know almost every patient of mine. I know what they are taking. I know if um, they have any certain health issues, what doctors they are going to, or if there's anything I can do for them even on the weekends when we are closed, they have my cell phone number to call me. So we want to make pharmacy a very personable adventure for them where they feel like they are coming to family and not just another um, retail pharmacy, another a corporate pharmacy where nobody knows them or cares about them, unfortunately. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I have met some of your staff and they are very friendly. Thank the you. customer Thank service you. is, uh, is mm -hmm. just paramount, especially when people mm -hmm. are, are not feeling well. And, That's uh, true. That's true. They need a friendly face. Mm -hmm. That's a real pick-me-up. They also need the, um, the uh, products that you well. So thank you for the sure, sure. service to our community. Mm -hmm. Now let's talk about <coughs> influenza. Mm -hmm. um, that's uh, a hot topic this time of uh, year. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. What are we expecting for sure? So uh, each year uh, the, flu vi the flu virus changes and each year flu vaccinations change. Um, uh, we do offer the, uh, the flu vaccination. In fact, we encourage it uh, it's very important for people to get the flu uh, vaccine, especially those that are older in age, uh, 65 years and older. Um, uh, we personally vaccinate from age nine and above, but um, the CDC does recommend anyone from six months and above to receive the flu vaccination. We highly recommend for patients who have chronic uh, so diseases to get it, patients who have any immune compromisation to get it, 65 years older because those, these are the patients that can have more complications because of the flu. If you think about flu, it's a lot of people believe it's just a bad cold, but it's way more than that. When with a bad cold, you are just looking at a couple of days of not feeling well. But when it's a flu, um, flu situation, you are going to experience a whole different set of symptoms you're going to feel like you're completely out of energy also we uh, recommend this a lot to parents because when you are sick your kids have the chances of getting sick that's the first thing and also you're not there for your you are not able to take care of them like you would like to so we definitely highly recommend it to parents also at the pharmacy like my uh, like we mentioned we can only do nine years and older but we do have a pediatrician on site also, so that's something you can consider too. Um, 
especially patients with diabetes, patients with respiratory uh, uh, diseases need to definitely get it. Now, a lot of times patients do say, oh, I got the flu shot, however, I got the flu. That is possible, however, you have to keep in mind, if you do get the flu shot, your symptoms are going to be way less severe. Complications are not going to happen as much as they would if you did not have the flu shot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, to emphasize how important it is to get the flu shot, you're going to give someone the flu shot today. Sure, sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be me. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm I'm pushing 65, folks. So I really need to get this uh, flu shot. So it is very important to get the flu. Yes. I don't have it ready. Would you give me a few minutes while you talk to Whipple, yes. and I can go grab it for you? We we will. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. We will wait for the sure. needle to arrive. Yes. Yeah. Sounds good. And we do okay. use thin needles, and she has a very gentle hand, so uh, from what well, I've heard... Well, we're about to find that out. Well, she has from, what I, from what I've heard from patients, right. they, they vary from saying uh, it pinched slightly to, wow, that was it? So, you know, most patients, they, they don't even... Tell. They don't even feel it. We use a very, very thin needle, and um, it won't be. I think you'll be, you'll be fine. Don't worry. I think so. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, um, your your business uh, specializes in all kind of kinds of pharmaceuticals. Uh, yes, sir. Um, we, you know, it, of course, we we are a full service pharmacy. We do carry um, all types of medications, and if we. In any, if we have any case where we don't have a particular medication, it only takes us one day to get it. Um, that's quite rare that we would not have a medication, but um, but still, you know, it's good for patients to know that not only would it only take one day to receive the medication, but we can come to their house and deliver it for free. Right, and that uh, delivery uh, of. Pharmacy. That that's something that back when I was a kid, it happened on a regular basis, and I think uh, um, a lot of people just phased it out. But it's, yeah. it's it's it sounds like it's making a comeback here in our community with your pharmacy. So that's great. Exactly. That's and again, terrific. you know, that's really where we wanted to. Um, that's the, what we were trying to do. We wanted to bring back that hometown feel. Uh, we wanted to bring back that. Um, um, you know, the pharmacy of P.J. Bean, right? Philip J. Bean was a physician back in the day who delivered most of the children in St. Mary's County. And uh, he used to go and do home visits. And so we wanted to bring back that feeling of, you know, the home visit and, um, uh, and, and let people know that we were willing to go the extra mile. We've traveled to... Uh, my wife, myself, and our four-year-old daughter, I mean, we've traveled all the way up to Alexandria to deliver a medication to somebody. Wow. Uh, yeah, I mean, they lived in, uh, they live in Leonardtown, but they had gone to visit um, their daughter in Alexandria. They forgot their heart medication, called us on a Sunday. We came, filled, what, three, uh, three pills uh, for them just because we knew that they were going to be there for three days. So we were able to fill those uh, three pills for them and... He's, he always tells us, I'm indebted to you guys because of you I didn't end up going to the hospital. That's what makes things and more And that gave us a family day out too. So that yeah. worked And we made a day of it. Yeah, we made a day of it with our family. So, you know. All right. So I guess we're ready now. You are ready. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what do I need to do? You need to tell me which arm you're getting your shot. Okay. Well, I'm a left-hander and I usually take it in the right. Okay. So you are going to... That way I can pitch. Go ahead and relax your arm. I'll move out here So just throw your arm down there. All right. Perfect. Relaxing that. Mm -hmm. See how easy this is? Then just going to make sure it's all clean. It could take a while. <laughs> I promise I'll not hurt you. So one of the biggest like our keys to the technique is for you to relax as much as anything. Okay, right. The more you relax, the less you feel anything. And there you go. 
You are all set. All right. Thank you. I'm vaccinated, folks. Mm -hmm. How about that? All right. Good for the whole year now. We want to thank both of the Shahs for mm -hmm. taking time out uh, and speaking with us today about uh, the pharmacy and the flu. And sure. um, let's hope we get through this uh, flu season uh, pretty much unscathed. But no, uh, we don't want to lose anybody in our community. So you get that so. shot. Thank you. Absolutely. Hope to see you and hope let's get better together. Yes. Let's get better together. Thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you. Thank you.